But in the case of Muhammad, he literally raised an army to himself. He fought battles and killed people. And he reaped the kinds of rewards that virtually every well-known warlord in history seeks for themselves. And in so doing, he seemed to conduct himself the way that a typical warlord would do. He executed prisoners of war who had surrendered. He took and sold slaves, including women and children. He took many wives for himself, including one that was so young, it says that she was six when they married and nine when he consummated that marriage. Jesus Christ, by contrast, seems to forsake the things of this life in teaching and example. The Bible depicts Jesus as someone who fasts, who deprives himself, who prays all night long, who performs miracles, who identifies with the lowest members of society, who protects children, and who is indifferent towards honor, wealth, and power.